What's up, data people? My name is Matthew Heffron, and today we're going to be covering numbers and trends in Metabase. So let's jump right into it. So the first thing we're going to do is ask Metabase a question. So we'll say new question. We're going to go to orders, pick the metric we want to see. We'll say sum of total, and we'll hit visualize. And that's it. We have a number. And this looks pretty boring, but when you drop this onto a dashboard, it puts it in a nice KPI card. You can add text so someone knows what this number is. And also you can add an information icon if you want to give additional details. So let's see, how do we make this into a trend chart? Well, we can come over here. We can say show editor and then pick a column to group by. We'll say created at. And we want to look at this by month. So we'll do that. We'll click visualize and then we'll click visualization and you'll see here that trend is now available for us. So we can click that and we have this nice little trend chart. I like how they, they do this for us and give you even this arrow. So it's kind of a pain to build in Tableau. So it's cool that it's this quick and easy. You can go ahead and switch the positive and negative numbers. And then we have kind of the typical options that we've seen in all these previous charts. So if you go to style, we can come over here, we can make that a currency. If we want, we could remove decimal places. So hope that lesson was helpful. If it is, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.